Hey guys, I'm The Hacksmith, and on our YouTube channel we take fictional ideas from comics, movies, and video games and make real working prototypes. Back in June, I took the team to see Men in Black International on opening night. It was an awesome movie, true to the classics, with all the aliens, gadgets, and more. It gave us a bunch of ideas of some tech that we could make real. And then, we got a mysterious phone call. The Men in Black reached out to us. As it turns out, they'd like to sponsor us to make a video, and your number one request was for us to make the Neuralizer. So, let's make it real. If we could all look right here. Just drive. Men in Black International is out on digital today and Blu-ray September 3rd, never before seen gag reel, the lead scenes, and more. Chris Hemsworth and Tessa Thompson are the perfect duo. I loved it, and I know you will too. Plus, make sure you watch the whole video because we're going to be giving away a neuralizer to one lucky fan. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. I don't think we, we can't, can we? No, it's illegal liability, that kind of things, and people can. Let's get started. There's no Men in Black if there's no neuralizer, and that was the hardest prop to redesign. So, how are we going to make it? Well, from an engineering standpoint, there's two main components to the build. There's the electronics, which includes the circuitry to drive the lights, and then the mechanical casing that holds it all together. Let's take a look at what kind of lights we could use, and then we'll figure out how we're going to do the mechanical case. Luckily, the props department actually sent us some behind-the-scenes photos, so we'll be able to make this look just like the one in the movie. To make it flash, we have two options. We can either use a flash from a disposable camera, something I feel like a lot of our younger audience has probably never seen before. Or we can use some high-powered LEDs like these. Now I believe the original Neuralizer probably used a camera flash, but modern LED technology has become quite impressive, so we're also going to test some of these LED modules. And to do that, Ben's actually whipped up quite a few prototypes to compare the two technologies. So this was the very first prototype we made. It was with a single 60 watt LED and 45 volts of capacitors. It's relatively bright, but doesn't last for very long, and that's due to the nature of the capacitors. The second prototype we made was also with capacitors, it was 42 volts, but six 9 watt LEDs. But the third and final prototype that we made was with a recycled camera flash. The advantage of it is we can recharge it constantly and fire it forever. All right, so the camera flash, it's actually pretty cool, but it really doesn't show that well on camera. And I think these high-powered LEDs actually look a lot more like it does in the movie. So we're gonna continue with that design. Oh, we're also gonna have to figure out how to make it make that noise that it does in the movie too. But we're gonna figure that out later. Time to start doing the 3D cab. Machining the casing for our neuralizer on our Tromboc CNC lathe. Now, we'll use our Tomox CNC mill to add the finer details. Machining, it's time to get the final assembly. Yeah. Right now I'm just soldering the um, heat sink pads together to give some rigid support between all six of the LEDs. So for the final design we need a way to hold the batteries in the casing and then allow them to transfer power. So exactly like a flashlight, the batteries are going to be inside of it, we're going to have a spring. 
spring is going to push down on the batteries and then short out to the casing. So the casing of flashlights are actually active. We're going to do the exact same thing with this. We're going to mount a little spring there and that's going to and it's going to ground the case of the neuralizer to the batteries and that's how we're going to transfer power. You can see the full circuit diagram by visiting our page on maker.io. To replicate the sound of the Neuralizer, we are using an Adafruit sound module we got from DigiKey. only in attire specially sanctioned by MIB Special Services. You will conform to the identity we give you. You will not stand out in any way. You are a rumor, recognizable only as deja vu and dismissed just as quickly. You are no longer part of the system. You are above the system, over it, beyond it. We're them, we're they. We are the men in black. Hey you, you've just been neuralized. You're watching this amazing Hacksmith video. You're gonna subscribe and hit that notification bell. And once you're done watching this video, you're gonna tell all your friends and watch it again and again and again. Hey, did, did I just beat YouTube? Infinite views. Hey, <laughs> let's have some more fun with this neuralizer. I should probably get a partner though. I'm so glad James had me up here. I get a whole month of vacation here at Hacksmith Industries. Hey, Jarvis. How's it going, James? Not too bad. Thanks for coming up. Absolutely. Rock, you look right here. Yeah. What is it? You're working for me now. I'm going to pay you five peanuts per week. Welcome to the team. Hey, Ian. Look at this. Here. Hey, remember that time that I was- Neural I just don't work on cyborgs, man. <laughs> hey, Evan, how's the Men in Black video looking? Oh, it's looking great. I'm done for the day, though. I think I'm gonna finish the rest tomorrow. Uh, can you look right here? Yeah. You're gonna finish this video before you leave today. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, there's tons to do. I, I gotta get back to work here. Excellent. All right, this is too much fun. Let's pick up some more metal and make more neuralizers. Right here. I think you'll find we've already paid the bill. Your bill's already been paid. Thank Have you. a great day. Well, that was a good day's work. Can you look right here? It's a brand new day. You better get back to work. Well, I got lots to do. Better get back to work. Well, that was a fun project. I think it turned out quite nicely. Let's try it again once more. Look right here. You just watched an amazing Hacksmith video. You're so impressed with it, you're gonna check out Men in Black International today on digital download using the link below. And you're gonna subscribe to our YouTube channel. And like we said at the beginning of the video, we're actually giving away this neuralizer to one lucky fan. All the contest details are in the description below. Good luck. Thanks for watching and have yourselves a fantastic day. Hey, Ian, like this. Oh. You remember that time that we had? No. Seriously, though, just uh, put on my tab. <laughs>